Hey here and welcome back to Life is Strange True Colors. Um, so last we left off, uh, last we left off, Alex uh, admitted that uh, Ethan was going to the mines and uh, I think her and Gabe are cool again but then the whole thing with Ethan happened so maybe they're not cool anymore. I don't know. It's, it's getting hard to tell. Anyway, let's just go ahead and keep going, shall we? Ethan? Ethan! Come on, pick up, pick up. Alex. This way. Wow. Been a while since I was up here. Should I be... I don't know, freaking out right now? In my experience, freaking out is almost never advisable. Any luck? In touch base with the safety team up at the site. We're gonna postpone tonight's blast until we find them. Oh. At least we're not racing the clock. Hey, you good? Charlotte's gotta be losing it right now. Hey, she's tough. Always has been. Come on, let's take a look around. This kid. Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from Dad if we'd done anything like this? I should have... said something earlier. I didn't... I mean, when he said he was going to the old mine... Alex, it's fine. You couldn't have known. It's not your fault. Yeah. Still, though. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of Ethan. Sure. I can... do that. How was Ethan planning to get into the mine? That is a good question. I on my first day. Maybe this fresh start is still salvageable. Excited to announce we have a new addition to the Black Lantern staff. Happy to have you, Alex. Maybe we could even teach Gabe a thing or two. Hey, she could teach me way more than you two. Wait, she could teach me way more than two things. She's a good sport. Glad you're finally here. Well, thanks, Jason. One of your neighbors has changed their relationship status. Riley is Something now single. Something tells me those two aren't the best match. Yikes. Proud of you, sweetie. Ouch, Mac. Mazel tov. I mean, everybody seems to be celebrating this, so... I think I did the right thing. I feel justified. So I guess we can't get in through the front door. I'm assuming. Cool. A murder bar. <laughs> Private property notice. Will we though? No trespassing. This area is the private property of Typhon Mining. Only authorized Typhon personnel are permitted. Violators will be prosecuted. Safety poster. Avoid this place at all costs. No. That's the tip. No. 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 Super no. Yep. Agreed. Mm. Open gate. What? Maybe Julie McNamara doesn't need your approval. Wait, Julie McNamara is a fucking skank. I mean, seriously? Weren't they saying that in the first I Life is Strange also? We'll have to wait until after we found Ethan. Like kids have nothing new to say? Zombie. The fuck? How is the rubber zombie the least creepy thing out here? I mean, yeah, that's a good question. They were gonna set off charges tonight. 
think God gave God a hold of them. Yeah, I was gonna ask, like, um, about that uh, two-hour warning for the detonation. When did that start? Let's see, automated blasting to take place Sunday, April 28, 2019, 9 p.m. Uh, what time is it now? Do we know? Does it tell us? Ducky. Dear Alex, it's very much my pleasure meeting you this evening. I hope you find a welcoming home here in Haven. I look very much forward to our next meeting. Sincerely, Reginald McAllister III. Okay, he seems like a sweetheart. Okay, um, so I read all that, so there's nothing new there, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Alright. Is that it? Wait. No, it's not. What's this? You don't realize until you're up close. But mining equipment is super murdery. It really is, The though. real monster here is underage drinking. <laughs> Alright, let's head into the mine. Oop. Come on, Ryan. Everyone is depending on you. Ryan won't let his fear get in the way. I'm glad he's here. Hello? Alex, why? Why didn't you? No point in blaming anyone. We just gotta find him. Fast. He's right. The only thing that matters now is finding Ethan. Wow. Once Ethan's safe, I'll raise one too. We raise our drinks to Jed Lucan, who at this location on December 30th, 2008, pulled us out of hell. I can't wait to hear more about that story. Alright, let's go in. Imagine being trapped down there. Or, actually, don't. What happened here? Massive cave-in. Bunch of trapped miners. All nearly died. Jed led the whole team back to the surface. God. Yeah, that's the day Foreman Jed became local hero Jed. And then Typhon closed up this site, basically bought Jed the Black Lantern. Huh. Same logo. Did Ethan base his comic on this place? Oh. Thanor, the tunnel to the mo monster stronghold of Demonheim, collapsed? Okay. Okay. If the wall is an illusion... Thanor, I'll have to find another way in. The uniform of the city guard, long dead from the looks of it. Blood. Let's see, this trail seems to end here. Unless... Hollow. Aha, he must have crawled through here. The corpse of a cloud serpent. It must have crashed through the ceiling. Perhaps if I can reach higher ground, I can find the secret entrance. Your flying days are over, cloud serpent, but you may still be of use to me. That globe, beyond the peak. That must be the stronghold's back gate. Okay. Nothing obvious. Maybe we should... Notice anything? No shit. I'll be damned. The whole story is about Ethan's character breaking into a monster stronghold deep underground. Sounds like the mind of me. Does it show where he went? Not sure. The comic ends with the monster hunter climbing a watchtower, which shows him where to go. There. The silo. I bet that's the tower. That's where he went. You're a genius. Yeah. Great find, Alex. Gabe, you want to take a crack at unlocking that gate? I'm on it. We should also be able to get to it through the processing building. If we can find a way in. Let's take a look then. Okay. Ethan based his comic on this place. Maybe I should compare his drawings with other stuff in the area. Okay. Right. Okay, there's the zombie. So if the zombie is here, then... The blood is going towards the other gate. Ethan really followed the path in his comic. Finding him just became a lot more doable. Went over here. Wait, 
so did Ethan? Oh man. I am a genius. Don't y'all ever fucking forget it. So he climbed up? How? 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 How again? <laughs> I think there's like a side door back there. I don't know. I can guess there might be. Give me a hand. Okay. <sighs> you figured that out from a comic book. God, Ethan's a good artist. I'm gonna try to get the lights on. You try to figure out where Ethan went. So, I mean, if I tried to draw that, nobody would have a clue where to find me. Ethan must have come through here. How did he get out? That is a good question. I got some good news for you. Okay, so... That looks familiar. But I guess there's some stairs nearby? Is what I'm gathering. During conversations, use R1 to swap between choices and objects. What? Uh... Go with red! It's always red! Nope. Thanor doesn't battle any bed bugs. I don't know. So much stuff just left behind. Sad shit. For sure. I hope Alex is right about this comic thing. We're burning minutes here. I hope so too. Yeah, it was worth a shot, I guess. Ethan must have passed through some other way. Let me see what I can figure out. Well, it looked like there were stairs. I just don't know where they were. I'm not confident this is gonna work. Yeah, me neither. If Ethan didn't get out through the door, how did he get out? Let's see. Where are the stairs? Ooh. Ugh. Let's hope omens aren't really a thing. Okay, that's nasty. Like, super nasty. Oh, there they are. Ethan must have gone upstairs. Pretty sure Ethan climbed these stairs. So, I'm a little confused. Has he been here before today? Because if this is him exploring today, I just wonder how the hell he knew about all this stuff. Okay, anyway. So, he went up the stairs. Uh, your flying days are over, clouds are may, may still be useful to me. Okay. Okay. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Oh. Not in the comic. Okay, well. Doesn't hurt to look. Damn. Maybe the window? Maybe he... He climbed... Oh, wait. I think he climbed to the conveyor belt. Which I'm just like, how? 
That is one athletic kid. Ethan made the jump from here to the conveyor belt? Oof. I think I'll find another way through. Looks like Ethan climbed the conveyor belt out to the silo. Yikes. See? That's why you need to keep your kids fat and lazy. Maybe there's some way to open the door. Because then they won't feel like doing any of this. Wasn't in the comic. Okay, well, I don't know what you want me to do here, Alex. You're not exactly making things easy. We passed caution like an hour ago. Okay, it must be something up here. She said that wasn't there. Ah, there we go. Heads up! You figured out the door! Yeah, turns out you gotta open it. Who knew? Yeah, don't forget, I'm a genius, remember? Alright, I'll be down there shortly, because apparently Alex doesn't want to run anymore. I'm just like, is there a run button? No, there's just one that snaps the camera right behind her. Okay, good to know. And I keep accidentally pressing L2, which is figuring out the emotions. Alright, let's go. What took you so long? You never forget how to break a lock. It's like riding a bike. Where to next, Alex? Thanor looks out from the watchtower and spots the secret entrance to the stronghold. If we can just... There. That's where he's heading. That's by the ravine. Shit! Let's go! Well, fingers crossed. I'm just like, man, as a kid, I was too lazy to do any of this shit. <laughs> like, I didn't want to be outside in the nature and the elements. Like, no thank you. Not my idea of a good time. We close? Things up. Ethan! 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 Get you out of here. Just hang on. Don't! Don't, 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 don't. His fear is so strong. If I get near it, it's no good. We're too heavy. Shit. 
What about me? Alex, uh, are you sure? Remember how I taught you how to anchor a belay? Awesome. Show me. You okay? Yeah. Yeah, I'm all right. You sure? It's okay if you're not. No, I'm good. No, I actually believe you when you say that. Alex, can you make eye contact with me? I'm gonna tie this rope around your waist. The other end is tied around your brother. He'll use that stump as a fulcrum to feed rope your direction. Follow? So far. Awesome. You're doing super good. Remember, slow is steady. Steady's fast. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. All right, we're going to walk the tightrope in the next episode. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share this with your friends, hit the bell so you don't miss an upload, and I'll see you guys next time. But I can't call away, so I'll stay halfway.